I know Viv since his, when he turned pro. It's got to be at least 10 years. Been with him for every fight up until, I hate to say this, when he lost. I was on the road working with some other people, and um, the record he has with me is win, win, win. So he had to come back home. Come on, baby, don't give up, bro. Come on, come on. This is eight. Yes, good. Let's go. Explode. Explode. Come on. Ten. Twenty-second jab. Go. So we did a little little basic stretching in the beginning. Now we're going to get them warm, warm them up, and then we're going to stretch a little more because we don't really want to stretch a muscle when it's real cold. That was just a little basic stretching. Now we're going to stretch him again right after he's warm. Vivian is nutritionally sound. You know, we put his diet together all year round. He comes to see me when he's not fighting and when he's fighting. So he doesn't have to go to camp to get in shape or lose weight. He goes to camp to get in better boxing shape. It's different. We develop his power, strength, and endurance, and now he's gonna to go to camp and he's gonna transfer to his boxing. Excellent, Viv, excellent. Heart rate? All right, 150. It'll take a minute, let's see where it comes down. <laughs> right after these quarters, he'll rest. We're gonna do 100 meter sprint. Murder. I try to get him down to under a minute and a half. And as the fight gets closer, we'll do 440s, 880s, 100-yard sprints with the rubber tubing harness, which you're going to see that today. And um, again, we try to get his recovery heart rate down as low as we can. That's when he's getting in shape. If his heart rate only comes down 20 beats per minute, he's not getting in shape. We need to get his heart rate down. Elevate it and bring it down in the middle. Look here, time out, time out, hey look, look, everybody hold up. We try to keep on stopping. I need him to get his heart rate from 170 and above. That's his anaerobic threshold. That's where you're really, really depleting your oxygen state. When you see guys come back to the corner and they're huffing and puffing, they haven't been training the right way. If you look at Margarito, he came down to the, when he fought Cotto, he came back to the uh, corner like he just took a walk. There's a guy that's in excellent cardiovascular condition shape. And that's what we want all our fighters. Jump, 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 jump.